sad and heartbreaking that, that there was a loss of life. Eloy is grieving a significant loss to the skydiving and ballooning community after a hot air balloon came crashing down around 7.50 Sunday morning. We have the world's largest drop zone. And so when this occurs into our community, uh, it affects us because the skydiving community is, is a large one and very very close-knit. Four people are dead, including three passengers and the balloon pilot. One passenger is being treated for critical injuries at a valley hospital. These types of accidents are very rare. Police say the balloon came from outside the city of Eloy. They're unaware of the intended flight plan, but knew it went up with 13 people on board. Eight of those people skydived toward the Eloy Municipal Airport. Shortly after their jump, eyewitnesses described seeing a catastrophic situation. They saw the last 10 seconds before the, the impact, and they said that the material of the, the balloon portion was just straight up. Hot air balloon pilot and safety expert Eliov Cohen tells me there's two reasons a hot air balloon might go straight up. It's most likely it's because of the skydiving operation and that caused that parachute to some reason float that then closes the mouth. So when they say it's up and down, at that point, you couldn't get any more air in. He says it's also possible the basket was too light after the eight skydivers jumped. If at that point there were a wind shear, uh, you know, big gusts of wind because it was lightly loaded, it could cause that as well. Now, normally loaded, you could not have that issue. Cohen tells me skydiving from a hot air balloon is incredibly reckless and risky for anyone on board. It's extremely, extremely uh, rare to float atop because it means you have to be going up at least 13, 14, 1500 feet a minute. And the balloon is not supposed to, by the manufacturer, go over a thousand feet per minute. The NTSB and FAA were on scene and will conduct a full investigation to figure out exactly what happened. That report could take weeks. Reporting in Eloy, Gabriela Becerra, 12 News. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.